Hi guys, today I'm going to present to you an interesting 40-foot container house. If this is your first time on my channel, let me introduce myself in a few words. My name is Ivan, and I love tiny houses. I travel to different countries and make videos about tiny houses to inspire you and show you the best examples. Subscribe to my channel to have a nice time with me and get some inspiration. So, let's talk about this wonderful house. It's a 40-foot container house. It is well insulated, suitable for living even in cold climates. Insulation is a 15-centimeter sputtering of polyurethane foam throughout the contour i.e. floors, walls, and roof, from the inside insulated with a 15-centimeter layer of it. From the outside, the facades of the house are metal container walls, not sheathed in any way, highlighting their pristine appearance. As we see, the container is purple. However, if we were to experiment a little bit and imagine that this house was made of a black container, we would see this version. I like the black color better. What do you think about the color of the exterior walls? Write in the comments below. The house is equipped with everything necessary for comfortable living. For example, at the entrance we see a terrace. There is also a similar terrace on the other side of the house. It is built along the whole length. This terrace can be accessed from the kitchen living room. It is very convenient. Here you can have breakfast or dinner and just relax admiring nature. The main feature of the house is the roof terrace. It brings a special vibe and architectural rhythm to the house. It's also practical. It provides additional space for use. The ladder to the terrace is quite comfortable and made of metal frame. From the terrace, you can gaze at the surrounding views, sunbathe in good weather, and do a lot of other things. There is a place under the staircase for storing firewood, which can be used to stoke the fireplace in the living room. A few more words about facade illumination. It is an important and indispensable part of the architecture of every house. In this case, there are some exterior lighting units mounted on the facades, which emphasize the style of the house. Now let's go inside. Here you can see the layout. The house has an entrance hall, a kitchen living room, a bedroom, and a toilet. This house is designed for two people. Let's start with the lobby. Here you can take off your outerwear and shoes and keep things. There is also an electric panel at the entrance. Next, we go into the combined kitchen living room. It has 15.5 square meters. It is really cozy and is decorated in bright colors. The height of the room to the ceiling is 2.5 meters. The container used here is a 40 foot high cube. The living room is divided into two parts. One part is the kitchen. The second part is the living room. 
The kitchen is equipped with everything necessary for cooking comfortably. A sink, a hob, a mini-fridge, and a microwave oven. The kitchen is separated from the living room by a bar at which you can sit and eat something, for example. In the living room area, we see a small sofa where you can lie down, relax, enjoy the spectacular view from the window. It is very nice to sit in the living room and look at nature. The window here is a kind of a cinema, a projection of the local scenery. Another feature of this house, of course, is the fireplace. During cold evenings, you can light it and heat the room. Speaking of heating, the house is heated with electric convectors. Now let's go to the bedroom. It is, of course, small, about 7 meters square, but nevertheless, it has a double bed and storage tables for clothes. The bathroom is located on the other side of the house. It is 2.8 square meters in size. There is a shower cabin, a sink, a toilet, a washing machine, and an electric water heater. There is also an extractor fan. Dear friends, that's all for today. Leave your impressions about this video and this wonderful house in the comments. See you in a new one.